exploring new territory at Ammonite Creek. All right, another one. Got that round look to it. And then right here, under these leaves, what do we have? Oh, a little baby Ammonite, yeah. All right, what's in this black box is top secret. But I'm gonna let the secret out. And look what I just found in the water. There's Ammonites that just do that right there and that's it. And I just found a massive one. I am back at Ammonite Creek. We're gonna walk around today, see what type of fossils we can find. I brought the kayak and explore new areas. And if you'd like to see more videos here at Ammonite Creek, don't forget to drop a thumbs up and leave me a comment. Now that we have all of that out of the way, let's get this adventure started. Kayaks loaded. We're gonna head upstream and right to the right is the cove. That little dark spot where every now and then I hear a growl that'll make the hairs on your neck stand up. Raindrops? Oh my gosh. It's pretty wild. We have all these concrete columns and there's an opening right up here. Just enough space to get my kayak through. Believe it or not, that thing will fit through there. And right in there is the feeder. We're gonna go check that feeder out. See if we can find some Native American artifacts and there should be lots of fossils up there. We have made land. I've been wanting to check this spot out for a very long time. But before we get started, time for a safety meeting. Lots of gravel. Not too far into it and I've already found something we're saving. Do you see it? it? Looks like a heart shaped rock. Oh yeah, that's a good one. This will be going in my mom's heart rock collection. Oh wow, lots of gravel. Ooh, this looks cool. Oh, looky here, looky here. Starting to notice some fossils. And look right up here. Look right up here. Oh man, piece of one. Dang. All right, an apple. I didn't bring much to eat. I'll definitely save that for later. Well, I've come to a dead end. I've got a pool of water that's over my waist. Huge catfish come out of. So now my options are to walk around that nasty grass or cross that log. I'm not finding anything over here. It's all gravel and it's just really going to go uphill. The more we go, it's going to elevate up. So my chances of finding fossils are going to be less and less. And I'm not seeing any signs of Native American artifacts. So, you know, we may just continue on with the fossil hunt. There's some areas I want to check downstream. Let's get down there and see what we can find.
working our way downstream now. I'm gonna go test that huge, heavy rock with my magnet. Several of you commented that if it's a meteorite, test it with a magnet, and you're so correct. I can't believe I never had my earth magnet with me to test these things. I don't know about you guys, it's time for another safety meeting. We cleaned this spot out pretty good, but that doesn't mean I missed one. The water has gone down even more since I've been over here last, so I may find one that was more submerged in water. That's what I'm looking for right now, and I noticed all of these little little shells. It's like a little little oysters or something. Here's one moving over here, but looks like he stopped. Here's one. I'm sure I've seen this before. That's not a bad half. Really good detail. I'm gonna keep that one. Here's a really big half. Check that thing out, oh my gosh. That is massive. That's like 15, 20 pounds. It's got some fossils right there embedded. Looks like we got a taco. Oh yeah, double-sided. That's good. That's good. Wow, look at this. Man, that is huge. That's about a foot and a half long fossilized plant some type of a plant looks like we have another heart shaped rock and this is probably the biggest one i've ever found check that out my mom's gonna freak when she sees this in her collection well i had to come back and get that really big huge ammonite that we found and i noticed this right here all right, another one. Yeah, double-sided a little bit. Got that round look to it. And then right here, under these leaves, what do we have? Oh, a little baby ammonite. <laughs> yeah, check that one out, guys. We did it. We did it. Successful trip at Ammonite Creek. We've got us a small ammonite. Now, that's so small. When you sign up for my element and gemstone collectors to skip the giveaways and i'll ship you ammonite you get one much bigger than this very cool i may save this one for my personal collection what's in this black box is top secret but it's time to let the secret out we need this tool that's right a magnet This is an earth magnet. I can already feel it wanting to pull to that. This is very strong. I can't even hardly pull it off of that. Now I may have found a meteorite downstream. Let's go test it. All right, getting a little ways from the kayak now. We've made it down the rapids. And I found a small ammonite. Check this one out, guys. It's a complete small ammonite woohoo look at that yes all right detail on both sides kind of but this has really good detail on this side look at that check that out all right looking pretty good today on the small ones and not far from that little ammonite is this purple looking rock or dark real heavy I've got my earth magnet Let's see if it's magnetized any nope it is not magnetic Ugh, it's just a big heavy black rock I didn't find a billion dollar meteorite dang it we 
we're doing pretty good on this adventure and we've found several small complete ammonites which is always fun it's a matter of time we get another one all my years of coming out here i've never seen the water stop running and as of now sunday july 31st 2022 the water has stopped running this water feeds dallas fort worth with fresh water and it's not even running it's drying up not good people wow this looks really cool nice and rounded huh almost like a tusk that might be some type of a tusk yep i believe that's going to be a tusk of some type maybe a mammoth tusk not far from where we just found those walking back up through here again yeah i'm jumping around notice right here we have a small ammonite is it complete yes both sides have detail Woohoo! that is awesome now that's more of the size i'll give away to my patreons when you sign up for your first monthly package if this is what you want if you want a huge quartz crystal just let me know and i'll send you a huge quartz crystal instead of this but i'd rather have this we are now at an area that's always underwater and right now because of the drought I am able to get down more into this pool and look for fossils and I see a really nice ammonite right over there Let's see if we can get over there yep looks to be complete oh yes look at that <laughs> Ooh, it's got a big hole in it man dang it still a cool looking ammonite let's flip it up oh huge hole oh look at this complete ammonite oh that's it that's the complete ammonite right there oh my gosh yes i think it's massive oh my gosh we really don't want to use this nasty water but oh my gosh guys this thing is massive and that's the complete that's it it spirals in and I don't believe it kept going. It's those pipe that have a huge hole in it. Let's see, I came in. Oh, I'm just gonna cut through all this. Screw the snakes. That's heavy. And the kayak's way up there. Uh, wow. 20 pounder it spirals in and then just kind of stops it doesn't like it used to just keep going some of these have holes in them i thought that was like a rare but actually there's ammonites that just do that right there and that's it and i just found a massive one whoo heck yeah once my channel reaches 50,000 subscribers i will add that to the arkansas diamond that i'll be giving away let's get this channel shared out i got it in the kayak let's go get some more and look what i just found in the water but yeah look at that ammonite hold your nose we're going under to check it out ready Look at this. What did I find here? One of those sand dollar looking fossils. Beside a huge ammonite. Golly, look at this one. Really faded, really smooth from the water just running over it through thousands of years it's just almost gone it's really smooth that's so crazy
Wow. <laughs> Amazing. Been walking around, walking around, and I just found a complete ammonite. Let's check it out together. Woo. Walking around, and I've walked over all this three times the other day, and look, we've had no rain. It's been sitting there the whole time. Yes! <laughs> Woo! That looks like a giveaway for my YouTube subscribers that leaves a comment on this video. Let's get this video up to 1,000 likes. One of you will own this. Winners announced on my Facebook page. I never leave comments on your comments, on my video comments, that you have won a prize to call this number, to message this, or email. That's not how I do my giveaways. Those are scams, people. Make sure you're paying attention to the profile picture and the name beside it they're gonna have weird things beside that picture of mine they're taking my picture and adding it to a name that's not my name so be aware of the scams all my winners are announced on my Facebook page now it's time to take a look at everything that I found up close with the better camera found quite a bit of fossils today we'll start off with this big one can't believe this hole and it appears to have just spiraled down and probably stopped right there it didn't completely keep going like some ammonites and this one also has little fossils embedded right here and right there several tacos such an incredible day several small ammonites to me this is some type of tusk and this right here is absolutely amazing the big fossilized plant to me and of course we have the heart-shaped rock this sand dollar type fossil always fun to find several banana shaped ammonites with good detail I hope you all enjoyed the adventure we found some amazing ammonites we got to see new areas here at ammonite creek I found a huge ammonite weighs like 20 pounds and it's a complete ammonite with a full hole in it. I'm starting to see more and more of those. So once again, I can't thank you all for the support here lately. All of my Patreons, YouTube subscribers, everybody that follows me on Facebook, commenting, liking my posts. That makes me want to keep going and keeps me motivated. Until next time, take care everybody. Thanks for watching.